Welcome back to Tag Across Europe. You're watching episode three, which means you either missed two episodes or you've already skipped this recap. Just as a reminder, in order to win, you have to reach your designated finish location while you're the runner. If no one reaches their destination by the end of the two remaining days, then the win goes to whoever's location is closest to the runner when the clock runs out. Right now, Adam is in Paris trying to earn enough coins to take a train to Rennes tomorrow morning. Thanks to pulling a curse card that means he can't use his phone anymore, Adam had to veto his last challenge, which means for the next 30 minutes he can't take any form of transportation. To make matters worse, Ben and I are minutes away from his location. I've lost his location. It looked like he was maybe moving. Oh no, wait, it looks like he's on Ile de la Cité. Isn't um, it towards us? Yeah. He literally could be anywhere. The tracker is showing me like a massive radius right now. Well, that seems to suggest. What is he wearing again? Uh, he's wearing like a little flannel shirt. Part one of the disguise is this soccer football jersey. I never wear soccer or football jerseys. Totally not my thing. I've got a wig. I got this bucket hat. I think if I'm like this in the subway, I might be fine. Now, you're probably thinking, well, Adam, what about your giant, super recognizable backpack? It's a great point. And that's exactly why I brought something for that. Exact. What's that? Oui. I don't speak French. I'm sorry. I I, I only speak English. Oh. Good to meet you. Let's move. I'll keep looking. What was he wearing again? I brought a trash bag, so I'm gonna put my bag in the trash bag. All right. I'm gonna take my microphone off because I think that is too obvious. And I'm gonna take, I'm gonna take the phone off the tripod. Oh, there are too many people. It's good for us. It's good for us too, right? It makes it hard to spot us, especially because he's not looking. But he's somewhere here. Maybe he spotted us and jumped in the sand. I'm assuming that they're on their way to my location now. That being the case, I think it's time for me to take my spot in the giant subway beats. I just have to survive for 20 more minutes. And I can take a subway somewhere. I just think the tracker is not very accurate, so I think we just need to be searching these streets. What the f***? What? John Green. We're filming jet lag. Hi. Hi, John Hi. Green. Oh my god. How are you guys doing? Uh, great. We're, oh my god. we're looking for Adam. We Have are searching Adam? for Adam. I haven't seen Adam. People are going to think this is a scripted cameo. It's not a scripted bit. I oh my god. my friend. I know him. Oh my god. John Green, you're filming, right? Yeah. yeah. Come from a champagne uh, <laughs> wine tour. We've come from 10, 12 hours of trains all day. <laughs> all right. We're very exposed, and Adam oh. is like right here. God, uh, do you have any advice for us finding him? Not, not. Uh, when, it, gotta go. when are you going to be on this, John? OK, bye, bye John. Bye, John. Just by the way, this disguise is unbelievably hot. It's already hot in this subway station. This is like low-key unbearable. What just happened? I don't know, it was John Green. That that was not scripted. We can't worry about John Green we right now. We need to get out of it. We're, we're halfway between oh, buses. Oh, okay. Here, watch out, watch out, watch out. That was amazing. We knew John Green was in Paris because he tweeted about it. And we were like, oh, it'd be so funny if John Green cameoed. On jet lag. <laughs> I was like, that doesn't sound like Adam. That was genuinely one of the strangest things that has ever happened. Okay, okay, concentrate, concentrate. We can, okay, we can okay, think about okay, how okay, okay. unbelievable that is. Okay, um, okay so it shows Adam back in the river, but I think. The majority, uh, okay, the majority of the time, the tracker is showed in these streets. So I okay. think we need to spend our time searching. It would make sense that the tracker would not be accurate in such dense crowds. Yes. So let's methodically search these streets. He's going he's gonna to be so mad about losing his shot to meet his hero, John Green. <laughs> no. Well, he should have gotten tagged sooner. All right. Only three minutes left. I think I'm going to make it. I'm going to start heading towards any subway. Just get on a piece of you know, let's advance kind of behind the cars. Oh 
Oh no, there's a subway exit entrance on the up there. He could be going into that. We're like right there. Okay. Shows well, it looks like he's in the block. Like he's in a building. Yeah, I mean, again, just like it's not that accurate. Well, could it have gone down to that subway station? Maybe. Just by the way, I'm not cheesing the GPS by doing this. I have service. I, I checked my uh, my tracking phone just to make sure I had service. I didn't do anything else with it, but I'm not like making it so that they can't find me without service. I have service. It's just this is a maze. So I think it's fair game. Okay. Okay. What does the tracker say now? So it's back to that location. It's back to that location in the river right there. So I think we need to kind of covertly scan that area. Oh, he can't be on that boat, can he? It shows him in the river. Here, Apple Maps now says it too. Could he, why would he be on a boat? All right, I have to wait a little bit for the train I'm taking. So I'm hiding in a little corner. I'm gonna pull a card really quick. Do 100 squats. For a full squat, your thighs must appear low to the ground. You may move or rest between squats. Okay. No time like the present, I guess. There's no way that he's like on a boat, but he could. There's a metro station that goes under the set, right? Yeah, but he's been there for a while. Could it be worth just going down there and checking? I'm just not sure why you would have been there for that long. Because yeah, we've been here for a good 15 minutes and it's like rush hour. So I can't imagine any trains would have taken longer than 15 minutes to come here. So I'm not sure why you would be in the metro station. Maybe he was being like indecisive. Maybe. There's so many people getting on this train. Uh-oh, oh no. Both trackers moved. Okay, trackers moved east. Okay. Towards Gare de Lyon. Should we go there? I mean, he's east, so he's not here anymore. I don't know if he's going to Gare de Lyon, but he's going that way. Oh man, it takes two different... Oh, f All right, let's go, let's go. Where would he have been here? He's like almost all the way to Gare de Lyon now. Well, we should go there too. I mean, if he's trying to set himself up to take a train first thing in the morning. Yeah, we gotta be there. I have no idea where I am. Okay, he's gone past the station. What I think that means is I think he's taken RER. Oh yeah, he's on the RER yellow line. Where does that take him? Just, just away, away from the city. Where am I? I'm at the bibliotheque here. So tomorrow, I just want to take the C all the way down to Massey Glacier. That feels doable, but I don't want to do it now because I'm worried that they'll figure out my plan. Mm, okay. Here's what would be a good move. So the RER uh, C line goes to Massey, and in Massey, there is, there are TGVs to rent. Let's look in the morning. Okay. Only a half hour until the rest period starts. If I can last until then, that'll be a really good starting place. All right, let's see how many squats I can do right off the bat. Where could he be going? I mean, maybe I mean, he's showing there. as being at Bibliothèque François Mitterrand. I, I think let's get on the one and get off at Gardeleon unless we can figure out something's changed. Just to get towards him for now. Right. Because we're only 29 minutes until the rest. And that is a potential place where we could intercept him. Yeah. I think I have about 10-ish minutes where I'm still safe, so. One, two. He's still there. Here's our train. We're headed to Gardner Lyon. 14, 15. 
Is he still there? Yep, he's still there. I mean, we could just try and get as physically close to him as possible. I guess that's probably the best bet at this point. So we'll get out there and we can like cross that bridge and then run down that street maybe. Yeah, I mean, maybe we could get him, I don't know. 21, 22. You know, I'm gonna make this be more out of the way. <laughs> Blocking people. 23, 24, 25. You know, I don't like my back being turned. We have 11 minutes. It says it's a 17 minute walk. Um, I think this way is better. Can you just get as close as possible? 68, 69, 70. You know, I was not uh, in the meeting where this challenge was come up with. I was on vacation. And I remember seeing it afterwards and being like, hey, Ben, 100 squats? That seems like a lot. And he was like, it'll be fine. 31, whew. 70, 72, 73. Where do we have to go? Where is he? Um, okay, actually, this one. 87, 88, 89, 90. Okay, 10 more. Almost there. God, I hope they don't show up right now because I am not going to be able to run. Is he still there? Uh, yeah, we need to get down. Down. 98, 99, 100. It's like the dumbest thing we've ever come up with. All right, that's another 500 coins. That's more than enough to safely get me all the way to St. Malo. He's over that bridge? Yeah. I am gonna go ahead and draw my next card here. Here's the deck. And here's the top one. Go exactly one mile. Close your eyes, spin in a circle, and point in a random direction. You must go as close as possible. The publicly accessible land to that location, exactly one mile in that direction. Well, um, I is down there. Down there? Okay. It's that way. What's that way? It takes me around 15 minutes to walk a mile. So I'm just gonna go about 15 minutes in that direction. I, I really hope that the audience feels that this is an appropriate interpretation of the challenge. I am doing my very best. Should we hide? Well, he's still far, far away, but I think we might want to stay on this side. Cause you see, he moved from here, you want to show? Yeah. He moves from there to there. So I think he's gonna cross. It's a big river here. It's very pretty. It's cool. Okay. I look so stupid. Oh. All comes to an end. You say it embarrassingly long. But I saw something about it. I think it was just like a jogger or something. Oh, that's it, that's it. It's 8 p.m. We're done. Oh my um, God. Okay, this is a great spot. We're very close to Adam. Okay, so let's show where Adam is. So we're there. Adam just went there, so that's his spot. 12, our Rue de Lambroisi. This sign, this sandwich sign. I'm gonna be exactly here. Why well, I like this spot is we can cut him off there if he's going to go to Lyon, and pretty much all the transit is from Gare de Lyon. So I like our spot. 
So these are the spots that we're gonna start at at 6 a.m. tomorrow. Yep. Okay. okay. And, but here's the thing, we gotta go, because he's probably gonna go to the same hotels as us. We don't want him to spot us now. So let's go back. Okay. Um, Good night, everyone. Good night. Okay, Morning. the second in turn six, we got to run. We got to run that way. So Adam is one block that way and one block that way. Yeah, so we got to cross this street and get one block in just as quickly as possible. Oh, it's six, let's go. Okay, we're back on. First things first, I don't want to do this, but I am vetoing the walk one mile card. I've thought about it and I just think, I cannot accurately get to exactly one mile away without using my phone. And if I can't do that, I don't think that I can actually complete the card. That sucks though. I really don't want to veto it because that again means that I'm a sitting duck for the next half hour. I can't take any forms of transportation. Do you have his location? Yeah. It looks like he might be going down this way towards this street. We sure? Well, cause he's, he was like here, I think. Now he's like here. Okay, let's wait for a movement. I'm trying to get on a 740 something train at a place called Massey Palace uh, something that I researched before I wasn't allowed to use my phone anymore. It's like a weird train station. that's really out of the way. You have to get to it on the subway. If I can get on that train, pretty sure I can get all the way to St. Malo, which is only one stop away from getting to Jersey. Let, let's cross this way. The question is, yeah, does he turn towards us or cross the bridge? Oh no, he's crossing the bridge. Let's go. Yeah. Oh, he's going to not the station that we thought. That's so weird. Maybe he was trying to throw us off yesterday when he was going the opposite direction from the station he wanted. Okay, for some reason, the tickets that I bought yesterday are not working. I need to find a way to buy new tickets. But I don't know if I can do that because my debit card doesn't seem to be working because I think my bank thinks there's fraud on my card because I'm buying things in Europe. And I cannot call my bank to tell them there is not fraud on my card because I cannot use my phone. We just gotta hope that the RER doesn't come in like the next five minutes. But our chances are good, because it's early. Come on, come on, come on. Purchase tickets. Come on, one, one ticket. Just one ticket. Please, dear God, work. Come on, come on. It didn't take it. It's not taking it. This is not good. It's gonna be right down there. There's a train coming. It's this direction. Okay, you go that way, I'll go this way. Box him in. Excuse me, could you swipe me in? I can give you 10 euros, but my, my card's not working. Could you swipe me through? Money. Yeah, I, I only have cash. Okay. Thank you. He definitely wasn't on there. I walked from side to side. Is he still back there? Yeah, but in a big circle. Okay, let's go. I don't know where to go. Or if he even got on anything. Okay, let's gotta go to the sea. There's so many different seas. I know I wanna go south, so I'm just gonna hope for the best. There's one at 631, that's really good. That's the exact time I wanted there to be one. Okay, come on. I mean, 
mean, there's a chance he's still in the station. Mm hmm Okay, I'm hanging out at the top of these, like, these stairs here, because hoping that'll make the GPS look weird, and also because if they show up, I have good exit options. He moved again on the tracker for me. Do you think we should go above ground? Like, he moved farther down the street. No, but his tracker is far too big for him to be above ground. I don't know if we can trust that. We, we haven't validated that at all. It seems like his tracker is just not very accurate. Because it keeps bouncing. So do you think we should go above ground? I guess, I guess so. Okay. I mean, I just tried taking this guy one stop. Wait at the next station for the next train. Okay, this is not where I intended to go, but this is an option. saw myself in the window. I look so stupid. All right. Train's left. It's, it's a good God, I hope this is going the right way. No movement? No. Lots of movement. Now it shows him here. Oh, he, he went the other way. So which? He's on the RER. Okay. How do we get on that? I don't know if we want to get on it. Let's see if we can figure out where he's going and cut him off. Okay. Um, so far, so good. Yeah, that's the RER yellow line. It doesn't go anywhere useful. It goes to Orly. Yeah, but there, there's, I don't think there's any flight that would get him anything useful. Yeah, Ren doesn't have a flight from Orly. London. Semelo doesn't have a flight from Orly. That's hypothetically possible, but what do you have the money? The only thing I could imagine is the TGV to Brest and Ren from Masi at 747. But that's an hour from now. Well, if he's doing that, then we have time to catch up. I mean, that's on the yellow line, so that's like a smart move. He's, I mean, he is headed that way. He's taking that unbelievably stupid wig off for a second. It's so hot. Oh, man. I keep looking around. I know they're not on here. I mean, I don't know, but I'm pretty sure. I think, I think we have to assume he's going to Massey. I mean, that's, that's the smartest move. Let's, let's go to Massey, because it's one hour until a train to exactly where he wants to go. Okay, calling an Uber. Okay, so we have to exit it. Here, you try first. Oh, God. Uh, why is there, t there's no human. Can't I just go through with you? Then we would get in trouble. No, I mean, if we're exiting now. Well, we can exit anyway. I think the exits are here. Oh, they just did that. Okay, get right behind me. Okay, come on. Hey, Uber there. Air bag, come on. Okay, this is Juvis. I think this is gonna be fine. So, according to this, the train will be here in 11 minutes, and it does go to Massey Palace U. So, so far, so good. It must be stop. I mean, he's, he's been at this Juvis station for a couple of minutes. Seems like we have a decent bit of time before Adam gets here. Yeah. This is where he's headed. So let's take a look. We'll have a good, good period to get into position. <sighs> I wonder what Sam and Ben's plan is right now. Are they trying to get here? Or, and this would be unfortunate, have they figured out that I'm going to Massey Palace That wouldn't be good. Because they might be able to beat me there. But I don't think they could, actually. The RERC, that's the one that Adam is heading here on. We should find the exit and then try to block off as many as possible um, and catch him before he notices us. Yep. 
Everything that's said. Oh, All right. On the train to uh, Nasty Palace 2. All right, I think we might be able to do this. It looks like this might be quite good because it looks like this might be the only exit. You see? It yeah. seems like there's a big choke point. Let's verify that. How far is he? Looks like he... He's still got some ways. Oh, yeah. Gosh, it's so pretty. It made even prettier by the fact that Ben and Sam aren't here. Okay. I think he's on the sea towards Versailles. It must be the 725. So we have 12 minutes. All right. Massey Palace here is the next stop. So the train I know left at 740 something, which means they're going to have about 25 minutes to try to get to me. Once they realize I'm stopped there. I don't think they can make that, but we'll see. We knew Adam would be getting in on these tracks, and the only exit was up these stairs into this long walkway. So our plan was simple, box him in. And we should do the box it in strategy. Post up here. Well, one of us posts up behind that and stays hidden. One of us posts up at the other side of this hallway. Sure. And then as soon as he goes in, we start kind of closing in on him. Okay, so let's get on like a call so we can coordinate. Test, test, can you hear me? Yeah. Okay. All right. We made it to Massey Palace Hue. This is absolutely huge. It looks like on the tracker that he's pulling in right now. Oh, there's there's a train pulling in. Okay, so that must be it. You see that? That must yeah. be it. Okay. All right, now's the moment. Unless they can get here in the next, like, 25 minutes, I'm making it to St. Malo today. All right, are passengers getting off yet? Um, it doesn't seem... It doesn't yeah, seem like there's a huge influx off. yet. But now people are starting to come out. Okay, I, I can see the platform from here. I have not yet seen Adam. All right, let's find out when that train actually does the... Right. People are really starting to come out now. And you have him on the tracker, he's definitely here now? He is here. Okay. Can I find the right ticket to get out of here? Let's find out. Oh, I see. I see him. 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 Oh, he's wearing no. He's wearing a green shirt. Green shirt. What color hat? He's not wearing a hat. Okay. Let's try this one. Does not like that. I think he's having trouble. Oh, can't let him get it back on the other. Yeah, he's having. He's, he's having, having trouble. That. He's having trouble getting through the gates. It's that. Okay. Oh, nice. He's wearing a green shirt. No hat. What do I do? Yeah. Skies. What do I do here? He must have bought the wrong ticket. Because yeah, when you, when you go further outside of the city center, you need a ticket that um, for like the outside Excuse zones. Me? You can't just get the, the one year on 91. Okay. So that's gotta be what he did. That's gonna take me. He's probably gonna have to find a human. Okay. I, I can't. It won't. I don't know how to get through. Okay, it's not good tickets. Okay, yeah. how do I get? I have okay. a bunch. Something doesn't change. So I'm gonna back up. Oh. Yeah, he's totally in disguise. Okay. He's, wearing, he's wearing a shirt that he would never wear. He's just, he's just getting through now. Someone just let him through. Okay. Okay, he's going down the bridge. Okay. I'm falling. Okay, let me know when he is far enough in that he can't get back to you faster than you can cut him off. Right. Okay? These are separate. Ah! <laughs> oh, I got him. Oh, that sucks so much! <laughs> No! 
No, how did you know I was coming here? Uh, because Sam is a train genius. Oh, I was so sure that this was like you weren't going to know about this. <laughs> I have so much footage of you struggling to get through this thing. Oh, you're in disguise, you bastard. What is this shirt? Shut up. Is that a wig? Adam has a wig. Is this a wig? This is a wig. Oh my God. Come on over here, Sam. Oh God, that's so frustrating. I really thought I had it. You were I was so like, close to leaving Paris. I just was so sure that you were gonna think I was gonna go not fucking like whatever. Yeah. I mean, again, there were lots of times. And also, how did you beat me here? Because the fastest we here I took, which was the fuck friggin' sea, is it? Fastest train. Did you take or did you cab here? Maybe. Where's his wig? I want to see your wig. That's hilarious. <laughs> oh my god, we're about to be on Google Street View. Wait, 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 wait. Jet lag feature. Um, uh, I was so, I, there's, I'm gonna look like such an idiot in the edit, because there's all this footage of me being like, all right, I got here, I'm feeling really good. Now that I'm here, I think there's no way that they can get me. Oh, that'll be so good. Uh, okay. All right, I'm doing a final shuffle. Okay, Ben, it is... 7.46. 7.46, which means that at 8.31, we'll start coming after you. Godspeed. Bye, gentlemen. Good luck. Goodbye. Yep. I think he's screwed. I don't think he has, like, any coins. This episode of Jetlag is unfortunately over. However, you can watch the next episode right now on Nebula. That's an appreciation of the fact that this show literally could not exist financially without everyone who signed up for Nebula. So they get every episode one week early, always one week ahead of YouTube. Um, right after that, of course, you should watch Crime Spree. That was kind of our pilot season of Jetlag. We made it before we even call it Jetlag the game. And it was before we figured out like all of the health and safety rules that we needed. So it's kind of the most chaotic season of Jetlag ever I would definitely give it a watch it's absolutely as fun but a little bit maybe less polished than uh, than the rest of the jet lag seasons and then right after that you could watch extremities that's another series that we make and we make this whole show about how and why the world's most remote human settlements exist what you know these these places that are some of the hardest places in the world to go to and right after that, there's this uh, documentary on Curiosity Stream. It's called Rent a Family Incorporated. Uh, it's about this agency in Japan that rents out actors to serve as fake family members in different social situations. It's a really interesting documentary. It's bizarre. It's fascinating. But the good news is all of this, all of this, both Curiosity Stream and Jetlag, is available through a bundle deal uh, with a special offer for Jetlag viewers at curiositystream.com slash jetlag. If you go to that link, our link, you get both streaming sites for an entire year for just $15, actually a little bit less, $14.79. That's a crazy good deal, and believe it or not, that actually really helps support us financially. This show only exists because of how many people have gone and signed up for that bundle deal. So make sure to click the button on screen or head to curiositystream.com slash jetlag to get access to both streaming sites for less than $15 a year, and you'll be supporting us. So thanks in advance for your support. Check Massey train station for Street View to tell us if we tell us if we made it. Let me see. Even if it's years in the future, check. Tell us if we made it on Google Street View, please.